so I am in my car now. Um, well, it's not for sure my car yet, but we are just looking at everything. It does have Bluetooth, so I've been trying to figure out how to make that work, and we got it work. It has heat seaters, everything like that. So we made it all work. Um, and yeah, it is super duper cute. My dad's driving it though. We're like trying to figure out if everything works and like you know how everything goes. So yeah, um, if we end up getting it, which I'm pretty yeah, sure, we're sure we are, I will do a car tour as soon as I can. Put my thingy there. Oh, this looks so cute from this angle. It like fits perfectly. I love it. So, I bought the car. Okay, now we're gonna drive it home and I'll show you guys it when I get there. Okay, so I just got home. My car is back here and I'm going to show you guys. I put everything in there already that I'm pretty sure is going to be in there all the time. Um, don't look at me right now. I look kind of like crap because we woke up at like 8 o'clock and drove out like an hour away to go get this car. So yeah, we ended up paying 6000 400 okay we ended up paying 6400 and originally it was like 6800 so we got like 400 off but i'm about to show you guys she is a 2014 Volkswagen Jetta she's black and she has sports mode i don't know if that's like a thing for Jettas but i don't know she has sports mode um so yeah she's 2014 she's black with tan interior so yeah let's just show you guys Okay, so this is the car right here. This is what she looks like in the front. And then she does have black rims. And then they have like a little silver detailing. And then the regular Volkswagen emblem. And then it is trimmed. It has like black right here. I mean silver right there. But then pretty much everything on the exterior is just all black. Okay, so I'm trying to show you the back without the license plate. But this is just what the back looks like right here. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what the truck looks like. So this is just what the trunk looks like. So it's pretty spacious. We're going to get my base installed, I think Tuesday. So that'll be back there somewhere. And then this is just what my keychain looks like. So it's just my Michael Kors wristlet, wallet thing, my house keys, and then the key to the car. So for Volkswagen, which is new, I had a push start before, but this one is actually like a key. You turn it on, which I don't really mind too much. So basically you open it like this and then this is the inside. There's like so many people walking around and I'm just like in my own world. So this is the side of the car. It was used so it does have a few like hiccups but we're going to get it detailed and cleaned up so it doesn't have that anymore. But basically this is just how you change the mirrors and this is just your unlock and your window controls and then that's the pop the trunk, the hood and then yeah basically everything like that. And then this is just an overview. So when you get in the car, this is just what your steering wheel looks like. So it just has the Volkswagen emblem and then this is how you can talk or to like, you know, use your Bluetooth and stuff. This is how you turn the volumes up and I haven't figured out what this is for yet, the arrows, but that's there. And then this is how, you know, you press to call someone and say, hey, I want to call, you know, who and who. And then the car does not have auto lights. So basically you have to, if you want like lights, you have to turn them on and off. And then I have no clue what this does at all. And then this is your blinkers and stuff. But hold on, let me turn the car on. So it's just like this. And then this is what the front looks like. So it has all of this stuff. And then this is just your blinkers. So, you know, right, left. And then this is your windshield wipers, all that good stuff. And that's pretty much basically the steering wheel. It's pretty self-explanatory, pretty simple. I like it. It's not like anything too crazy that I need to know. It's very just like basic and easy. And then you move over to the dash and the radio and all of that. So here is where your hazard lights are. So your flashers, whatever. And then your air conditioning vents. And then it does actually have Bluetooth. So 
that's really really nice I really like that um, and then you can go to you know the radio whatever you want to do but I just like Bluetooth um, so I can play my own music and that's how you just turn it up down to tune whatever you know however you want to do that it also does have a CD in case you want to do that way um, and then here is your air conditioning and all that so this actually does have seat warmers so in the winter that's going to be super duper nice I hope this was not showing this whole time. Oh, and then another thing over here for the how to change your mirrors and stuff, it does have a defroster. So if it's like really wintry and this gets like defrosty or whatever, I don't know how to explain it. But like you know how you have the defrost for here, you can also defrost your mirrors. So that's really nice. And the, my favorite feature is honestly the heated seats because my mom has it. And in the winter, it's going to be so, so freaking nice because leather seats get so cold. So I really love that. And then, you know, just your basic air conditioning stuff. And then down here is kind of a little bit different. So down here is where I have my port for my charger. But it also has this little thing. So it's not like one of those ones that just like comes open and closes. It's actually like a whole thing that comes off. So that's different. And then I just have my aux right here. And then back here, all I have is my chapstick that I wear all the time when I'm in the car. And then I have my Quay sunglasses, just an extra pair. I keep those right there because they wouldn't fit really anywhere else. And then this is the gear shift. So it just has park, reverse, neutral, drive, and then if you're going uphill, you know, whatever. And then also has sports mode. Um, and I do not know how, I don't, I don't know if these are the paddle shifters or what the heck is on this car. Like, I don't know. I'm not a car person, but I do know that the S means sports because we looked in the manual. So that was pretty cool. And then this is your emergency brake. So my other car, the emergency brake was down there. So that's different. My sister's, however, is like this. So it's not like too, too crazy. But then right here, you just have two cup holders really nice and then this is the middle console so in here I just have so far I just put in my perfume that I really like and then I have two air fresheners this is just the Japanese cherry blossom and the eucalyptus mint one and then in this bag right here I have just like my aux cord I don't know if you guys can even see this I just have like my aux cord an extra one of these things because in the back you'll see in a minute it has another one of those charger ports and then I also have the thing in case I want to charge my camera so I have that and then also if you guys know what this is for let me know because I have no clue but it's in my car so I kind of want to figure out what this little port is for but then this Thing. it goes all the way down but if you come like you pull it up then it stops you know however high you want your arm to sit so I really like that I just keep it at this one like the one up and then this is the passenger side so the passenger side just looks exactly like the drivers except for it just has that and that and then it has the glove box so this is what the glove box looks like these are just pretty much all the same stuff that I had in my old car I just moved it into the new car so this is just my Kleenex wipes. I like to have wipes for anything like spills or anything like that in the car. I That's like one of my biggest hacks. And then this bag, all I have is just some eye drops. I have some like cleaning wipes for girls. I have a tampon and I have two different mascaras because I'm always forgetting mascaras and then I'm freaking out. So that's just like my little kind of cosmetics bag. And then also something that's really cool is this car actually has like like a little pin thing so you can store a pin in here so you don't have to have one just floating around. And then I have another perfume and this is just the Pretty as Peach one by Bath & Body Works. So that is all that is in the glove box. And then I have the same little like drive with me thing or like angels are watching, you know, whatever. Don't text and drive type little, I don't know. My, we all have one in our car in my family. So I put it back in my car. Up here is where the little things are. So right here is just my grandparents um, door opener because I'm gonna be house sitting. So I have that. And then this is just what it looks like. It's a little bit crackled, but it's not really bad and then you just open it and that's how it turns on and then I have a picture of me Victoria and Becca there it's kind of loose but we'll figure it out and then up here is where you can store some glasses so I just have the ones that I pretty much wear every day and then this are I, this is your speakers or something I don't know really what they are um, I think that's for the Bluetooth but then they have these little buttons. I don't really know what they do. Um, I'm not a car person, like I said. But then these are your lights right here. And then over here is my passenger side um, mirror. So same thing. And then this is something that my sister got me. I need, it's from Bath & Body Works. It's like a little mini hedgehog thing. Um, and I need to get some fragrance to put in it. But I finally put it in my car. I'm super excited to have it. So yeah, that is the 
front of my car so now i'm gonna show you guys the back seat but real quickly before i do that i just want to say that i paid for this car completely all by myself so it's not like like my parents bought me my first car like my first car fully was bought by my parents and I was super duper grateful for it and very very thankful but this car was paid for fully by myself so it's like something you know like I worked hard for it and I'm very very proud of myself um and I couldn't thank you guys enough because you guys did help me buy this car because without my channel and without you guys watching my ads and you know helping me out in that way I wouldn't have the money to buy my own car so I'm really really thankful and I just want to say thank you to you guys for helping me get to where I am because it really means a lot of, it really means a lot to me and like I said youtubers wouldn't be like where they are without their subscribers so genuinely everything I do is thanks to you so thank you guys I love you guys so much but yeah I did want to put that out there that I paid for this car by myself my parents did not give me any money whatsoever to pay for it so yeah really proud of myself for that so this is just what the back looks like so in the back these are what the side doors look like they're the same on both sides obviously and then this is just my windshield thing but I haven't tried it out and I have no clue where to put it so that's just where it's sitting for now but then in the back seat um all the the seats have like um the bottom seats have all these like rubber mats so that's really really nice they're gonna be super duper easy to clean so much better than fabric ones because you can just like literally hose it down which i really like then right here is where you can charge which i really 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 like because my kia did not actually have that so that's really really nice and then to actually open and close the door the lock is right here and then you have this little compartment i don't know what you would put there but you have that and then you also have this one and then this seat does not actually have like something you can put stuff in but this one does and so yeah it just looks like that and then the car looks the same on this side oh and also this the doors have two speakers so there's a speaker here and a speaker there and then in the front i don't know if you guys can see but there's a speaker down there and then there's a speaker up there by the window thing and then this is just what the seats look like so yeah they just look like that and then you pull it down and this is where your cup holder is and then also a super duper cool feature that this car has that i have not had a car to have this yet but you can use this thing and then you can go straight into the trunk so i think that's super duper cool when my friend had a car like this a long time ago when i was younger i used like when i could fit like it was a little bit bigger than this but i could literally like crawl through and back and i just thought it was the coolest thing so this just like brings back childhood memories and i think it's super duper cool so yeah that is just the back seat but yeah i hope you guys liked this video i'm super duper excited this car's not insured yet so we need to go get insurance and we need to fix the whole title situation i'm going to attempt to get a custom license plate i really want to get it say subway and i'm gonna deck it out i'm gonna get like a glitter steering wheel probably or diamonds and stuff like i really want to make this car super duper cute in me because i feel like with my red kia i couldn't really do that i mean like i could but i didn't want to in a way because the car was red so i feel like there wasn't really much options that you could do but since this car is black and a neutral color i really really like that because i can like jazz everything up and just make it my own and i've always 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 wanted either a black or a white car so like you guys don't understand how like excited i am to finally have a black car like wow i am in love like i literally love this car so freaking much so i'm super super excited and um maybe i'll make a like biscoing my car because i know a lot of people wanted me to do that so maybe i'll do that in my next video i don't know um stay tuned but yeah i hope you guys liked this video if you did give it a thumbs up also don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below to become part of the hashtag sub nation and do not forget to turn on your post notifications so that you can be notified whenever i post but this video's post notification shout out goes to this person like I, I need to get better with like picking these out so i can say you guys names again but i just keep forgetting so yeah thank you so much for having my post notifications on it does mean a lot and i'll see you guys in my next video bye